Hi guys, this is Gaurav and in this video I'm going to tell you some cool features of Google Keyboard. So if you don't have Google Keyboard, first of all what you need to do, you need to go to the Play Store and search for Google Keyboard. Once you will search for that, you can simply install that by clicking on install. Now I have already installed Google Keyboard in my cell phone. Once Google Keyboard is installed, you need to select the input method and you need to select Google Keyboard language and input and current keyboard should be google keyboard once you have selected that after that you can enjoy the cool features of it for example if i'm writing a message and i made a mistake so what i need to do if i want to move my cursor i can simply move it by using spacebar as mouse so you can see that what I'm doing right now, I'm just sliding my finger on the space bar and I can use it as a mouse. I can move the cursor. So I can take the advantage of it. So this is the first very cool trick which you can use. You can use the space bar, you can slide your finger on it and it will work as a mouse. So the second feature about which I'm going to talk about how to delete. So if you are going to delete something, you don't need to press the backspace again and again. You know, this is a very difficult method to delete. What you can do, you can slide your finger on the backspace and you can select the complete line which you want to delete and it will be deleted. Let me show you how. For example, I selected this and it will be deleted. So it's pretty easy guys. What you need to do, let me show you again, slide your finger on the backspace. Do not hit it again and again. Just slide your finger. Select the line which you want to delete. I'll delete how are you. And it is deleted. So that's the second very cool feature of Google Keyboard which you can use to delete something. So if you want to capitalize a word in your sentence, you don't need to press the caps lock key again and again. All what you need to do, you need to slide your finger from the caps lock key to the letter which you want to write. And let me show you how. In the same way, you can also add symbols to your sentence. You just need to place your finger on the symbols key and as soon as you will do that you would be able to see symbols on your keyboard. So what you need to do you just need to slide your finger from the symbols key to any symbol. That's it and it will be back to your alphabet keyboard. Let me show you again how. And you can add any symbol. You can add any numeric as well. So again it will save you a few taps guys. So if you don't like the boring theme of this Google keyboard, you can change that as well. All what you need to do, you need to go to the settings of your cell phone. Go to additional settings, language and input and select Google keyboard. Once you will select that, you will see an option for theme. Select theme. And if you want to select these colors, you can also select these beautiful colors for your keyboard. And if you don't like them as well, you can click on my image. And you can simply go to your gallery and you can select any image over there. For example, I selected this image with one of my friend. Select the image, click on next and you can adjust the brightness as well. So adjust the brightness and after that you can select key border if you want or if you don't want that. So once you have selected image, I believe I don't want key border so that I can see the image clearly. Once I have selected that, now the theme has been changed. If I'll go to my Google keyboard, I can see this beautiful image with one of my friends and it's not boring for me and I can change it every day. 